Many words and phrases have a naval origin, and some of them might surprise you. Let's talk about one of the more surprising and common phrases, by and large. This phrase is the combination of two separate nautical terms, the terms by and, well, large. By typically means in the direction of, so if you're sailing into the wind, you're sailing by the wind. Large means the opposite, that you're sailing with the wind rather than against it. This term doesn't refer to large like we would use the word large today. Instead, it has a similar meaning to at large when referring to a fugitive. Something large in this sense means that it has the freedom to move around, just like a ship does when it has the wind at its back. When sailing with the wind at its back, a ship can turn freely and move without risk. Whereas sailing into the wind, a sailing ship is much more limited in how it can turn and maneuver safely. A common misconception is that sailing ships couldn't sail against the direction that the wind was blowing. However, they could by sailing at just a slight angle to the wind. So if their destination was in the direction of the wind, they would zigzag towards their destination. However, if they sailed directly into the wind, the ship would come to a standstill, and it could actually damage the masts. This was called being taken aback, as the wind had taken the sails backwards. So a ship sailing into the wind was not large and free to maneuver easily, like a fugitive not at large isn't free. Over time, the meaning of by and large has morphed into meaning in general or overall. Just like how if a ship could handle well, by and large, it could handle well sailing both with and against the wind. In other words, it handled well overall.